So if you think of the omoplata, it's basically a kimura with his lower body. It's a shoulder lock where he's keeping my uh, arm at a 90 degree angle more or less and attacking my shoulder with rotation. Uh, there can be two versions. If he's good, what he's going to realize immediately is that I've countered the traditional omoplata, which is vertical pressure. He's going to lift his hips and rotate horizontally. This is analogous to uh, a Kimura from here where he's kind of driving me horizontally versus here where he's rotating me vertically, right? And he can do, if he's a good fighter and he's fluent with his lower body as anyone in jiu-jitsu should be, he's gonna make that conversion and I have to be ready for it. We're back to that base versus space. He can't crowd me and lift his hips at the same time. So I'm gonna use that hip lift to get under and reverse him. So again, it's all predicated on the fact though that I can stop his traditional, conventional, vertical omoplata pressure. So I drop in here and I've stopped his conventional omoplata and he's gonna start lifting my, his hips to lift my wrist and walking me across, yeah. And keep the figure four closed for now because we're gonna do the open version next. Mm -hmm. He's keeping the figure four tight He's using this, he, his, his base is kind of like a technical stand-up, right? Yeah, he does a technical stand-up and he shoves his hip across me. And eventually, he puts me in like a north-south type kimura here. I go from in front of my body to behind my body. So again, it takes a while for him to do that. It's very telegraphic. If my vision is expansive enough, I see it coming and I react accordingly. We're gonna undercut, okay? Um, it's, it's pretty easy because he has to at least get above my hips. So bigger people, it's higher, uh, thinner people, it's lower. But I know he's got to get over this because otherwise I'll be, my arm will be here and his hip will be here and nothing will happen. He's got to get up and over and push me across. So when that happens, we're almost out of here. And I feel him start to elevate. I'm immediately going to do that reverse shrimp motion again. He tries to tap me. And I'm coming on this side, right? I'm just coming to the other side. 